Yo, what's going on everybody, it's iPod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. What's going on to all my defensive forces out there, all my people that ain't scared to play on-ball defense online, all my people that's out there playing my player mode and create a legend mode, having a stick defense just because you got to. If you don't stick defense, you're gonna get burned. It's simple as that. Like Michael Jordan said, man, if you reach, I teach. So if you reaching, I don't know, man, he might be doing the teaching. But let me jump into what I want to talk about. Speaking of defense, now, they're saying in NBA 2K13 that players will have more smooth movements on defense to appear, appear more reactive. Now, they're saying that physics will be implemented in this game and it will help more physical defenders guarding against drivers to the basket as well. They say if you step into a dribbler's lane, the collision deflects guys the way it would in real life. So the attacker wouldn't just slide off a defender, like how D-Wade slides off a defender's now this year and he goes straight to the paint. They're saying if D-Wade came up against me in my player mode, against the stat sheet stuffer on a switch, and I was sticking him, I would bump D-Wade, but I wouldn't bump him back. I would bump him and stop his momentum, and it would be his choice on if he has to stop on a dime, or if he's going to spin behind his back, do a crossover within that animation, do a nice little spin move off me, it's his choice. Because as a defender, you have the right of way to stop that defender when you beat him to the spot. Now, the dev team hopes that this will help players feel like defending can be a more vital role in the game instead of just feeling like an obstacle such as you know people that play online they're playing power forward to center waiting for you to come to the paint letting the computer guard you the entire game and stuff like that now me i don't see that as an obstacle that's why i play team up i rather stick a person that's you know what i'm saying controlling the sticks because i know when i come down in the other end of the court he gotta stick me and that's a problem so they say last year which is nba 2k12 they say that the AI had multiple options to attack your defense, but it would pick one approach at random, which means to cut down the amount of time that it takes, a player can cheat the system by, you know, playing the passing lanes, picking off the ball, inbound steals, and stuff like that. So what they saying is, Visual Concepts has developed a reactive AI that is smart enough to know when you are trying to take away an option, which means if you're playing up on a point guard on an inbound pass, hopefully they just straight up pass it to the shooting guard or that person uh, runs straight to the ball instead of running backwards and side to side. Also, when you're playing the passing lanes on defense, which means the point guard is up top, you're on the wing, shooting guard or small forward, and you're taking away that option to pass the ball, but you know that the computer is supposed to make that pass, they're saying that now, that player that's waiting for that pass, they're going to cut back door on you. Or it might be a nice little screen cut back door. they saying that they have more options this year. they saying that the guy will notice that you're jumping the lane and look for a back door option instead of throwing the obvious pass. Wow. It's going to be a problem for a lot of people out there that think they're going to get a lot of steals. I don't know, man. I'm going to have to check it out. Hopefully, I can still play my passing lanes. You know I love I love being an AI at 2K. I love picking off them passing lanes. Being a great defender, that's what you had to do on 2K12. You really couldn't play face up and get, you know, on-ball steals, but we will see. But I think that defense has been upgraded, and I like it. But this is IKC signing out. If you want more info about NBA 2K13, you know where to come and get it. Hit me up on Twitter at iPodKingCarter. And I'm out, y'all. Peace.